Good morning. Welcome to Morning Coffee with the Breakfast Crew. Um, I, I don't remember where we left off. I know we're ha in a dire situation right now where we're seriously lacking oxygen. We're working on our non-traditional oxygen up here, though. So that's something. So much not so good stuff oh yeah the mercury issue more oh this is gonna be trouble you know what I should do I should take this pipe and actually extend it up here put that there okay let's um okay that's at a nine good let's let's see who's working on what right now we're doing a research Advanced power regulation. We're close. I don't remember why we're working on this one specifically. Oh, yeah, we want to get... We need to get the automation going so that life is a lot easier for us. That's what it is. Because right now, we have to move these eggs manually out of the farms. See, just like this. Oh, we got a Bimini egg there. We got one of those guys there. And so we don't want them in there, otherwise they stop making eggs. I find it funny that these body temperature low. Wow. So how you doing? It's been a whole nother week. Oh, we finished that research. Perfect. Um, we'll just keep going. Let it keep rolling. So, come on guys, somebody get farming. There you go, that's what we need. We need that oxygen so badly, so badly. I'm sure that this, this concept up here is not gonna work very well. But, oh hey, you're studying it? I did not expect that. Hey, there we go. That worked. I just hope we get this stuff out of here. It's going to be a huge mess eventually. And actually, this thing, that thing should not be there. Let's put that there. These guys are active. We have the power. Now we just need the rest of this stuff to work. But still, it's going pretty good. Um... So I've been playing another colony in my spare time. And I'm like a few thousand days in, or cycles, or whatever you want to say. And wow. It, uh, it's, uh, it's, it's gotten crazy with me being in space and all that sort of stuff. So I, I've, I've installed this blueprint mod. Mind you, the blueprint mod itself, I think, is broken. Because, like, look at that. But it, it seems to mostly work if I... If I okay, there, there's my blueprint one blueprint. I don't know how to choose the blueprint. Because, like, as you can see, that's all we got. These are our options. Um, but, yeah. Why is... Why? I wonder why that one said it couldn't build there. Huh, I don't know. Ooh, what do we get? What do we get? So, as you can see here, I've got um, duplicate stat selector, which lets me actually choose what I'm getting. I'm not going to do that. I do that in my, my, my personal playthrough just because it's simple and easy, but, oh man, we're going to run out of food with all this low oxygen if we're not careful. There's not enough pressure for anything to even grow. Animals are going to die. Yeah, look at that. They're starving because there's just not enough oxygen. Oh, look, here we go. Okay, so oxygen. Perfect. Now all we gotta do, like, literally all we gotta do, so let's look at our... Okay, so we need you and you for now. Oh, we need power? Did we already run, we ran this power, right? Yeah, we did. Okay, good. Oh, that, that power there. That one is a nine. Okay. So 
actually put this up to a nine as well. There. And that'll be our start. Hopefully we get this stuff done. This is going to be a huge mess of freaking mercury and water and stuff. Luckily this stuff comes out cold. That shouldn't be too much trouble. I'm just afraid of what's going to happen up here in space. Oh boy. Honestly, I, I've grown to not like the frozen planet very much. It's a pain in my butt. Anyway, let's let let's just kind of sit back and let's let's watch who's working up here. Oh, you you are, are you monkey and McKen and uh, Mackenzie. Monkey's all like, forget about your research. I'm gonna go and look at this uh, geyser over here. It's very interesting, isn't it? Very very. But yeah, this is, luckily, I, I don't think it's going to exchange temperature with the um, materials on the ground. Hopefully not too much, but we'll see. We don't have any filtration medium? Are you kidding me? Oh, that's right. We get it from crushing things, don't we? What do we crush? Um, this gives us some sand here. Not a lot. Not a lot. Oh boy. Huh. I know that from hot dirt. Yeah, rock crusher is basically the only way to get sand. We can turn, you know, we can just turn some stone in the sand easy enough. I don't think that should be too much trouble. Like, how quickly does this stuff go through? Anyway, 100, no, 133 grams a second. That's a lot of sand, isn't it? That's phosphorite and clay. Oh, we get fossil becomes lime and sedimentary, huh? Do we have some fossil? Fossil. We have a little bit of fossil. Not enough to worry about. 24 tons of iron ore. Yeah, that, that'll get us some sand. This room won't be very useful if we can't actually filter the stuff in it, though. How many crash satellites does one guy need? Hmm. Hmm. It's kind of having to look around to see what's... Ah, oh, snow, more snow, but no sand. Oh, here's all of our sand. Lots of sand over here. Okay. That's good to know. It's very good to know. The next question is like, what do I do? Do I, it, like obviously, soon enough I'm gonna have to go through the actual um, teleporter. See what's on the other side there. We've got, we've got fuel. Oh, it's a, it's a, uh, oh, that's not a good one. That's not a very good one. Carbon dioxide, sulfur, and oil. That's gonna be a rough life over here. Whoever gets it. Actually, maybe it's not so bad. Maybe maybe they'll be happy over there because they won't be freezing their butts off. Oh, would you look at that? We've got oxygen. I did not expect that was going to la be that quick. Start there. Destruction. We'll get somewhere. Oh, is everybody sleepy? Oh, check it out. I've got I've got a new new bed design. Oh. I thought I got a new bed design. Hold on. I swear. I 
I unlocked? Oh, it's a comfy bed design. I see. This guy right there. I thought, I swear I thought it was one of the something else. Oh, look at that. I didn't know, oh, that's cute. See, I'm starting to unlock more things, so that's, that's nice. Oh, look at that. I didn't even realize that we had all these other things from this. Very cute. Anyway, okay, let's go back to the game. They're sleeping. Oh, what happened, Weeboo? Is it, oh, it's breakfast time. What are we eating today? Oh, yummy pike apple skewers. Yum, yum, yum. How are we doing on oxygen down here? Not so great. We have some some oxalite here. Not bad. So I've been jetting around in rockets in my other playthrough, and man, that really does kind of change the gameplay. I have so many ideas now for this world if I ever get there. I uh, literally sent two dupes off to a planet where they froze to death because it was even colder than this asteroid. Kind of crazy if you ask me. I don't know that this room is going to work as well as I hope, but we'll see. Oh yeah, monkey's got to study that geyser. So like, if we look at the room, it doesn't have a lot of oxygen stuff in here, but it will. It will. Just give it time. Because, like, the polluted oxygen is still spreading and freezing, and... Like, it's not emitting... I think, I feel like this may need to go even bigger this way. All the way to the edge. That may actually work out okay. Hmm. Is that really gonna be what we want? I think that'll be fine. Oh, let's inspect. We got a new entry. Let's see what it is. Mystery Project wins Nanotech Award. Last night's Worldwide Nanotech Awards has sparked controversy in the scientific community after it was announced that the top prize has been awarded to a project whose details could not be publicly disclosed. That sounds cheap and wrong. The highly classified paper was presented to the jury in a closed session by lead researcher Dr. Liling Pai, recipient of the inaugural Gravitas Accelerator Scholarship at the Ilion University of Science and Technology. Head judge Dr. Elias Balko acknowledges that it was unorthodox, but defends the decisions where scientists, it's our job to push boundaries. Pi was awarded the coveted Halas Medal, the top prize for innovation in the field. I wish I could tell you more, says Pi. I'm so grateful to the WNA for this great honor and to Dr. Stern for funding. I made it all possible. It's going to change everything about, well, everything. A second time that she's made headlines. Last year, the striking young nanoscientist won the Miss Planetary Bell Pageant Talent Show with a live demonstration of nanobots weaving a ball gown out of fibers harvested from common houseplants. Oh, is she the one who destroys the world? Is it her fault? Probably. I should probably put, like, a pressure sensor on this thing, too. But for now, I'm just going to let it run until it's... Wow, that room is so empty of any oxygen. It's a little crazy. One ladder there. They're so busy. Yeah, I need more dupes. I shouldn't, but I need them. I need them. I need more dupes. I guess now that this thing is up and running, or well, it's not up and running yet. I mean, like, look at it. It's... It is... Emitting polluted water at four kilograms a second, and it's barely doing anything because, like, it's so cold around it. It's just freezing, right? I don't know what's happening exactly, but 
It should spread. Spread that. See? Yeah, yeah. Look at that. That polluted ice is just getting bigger and bigger and bigger and bigger. I love it. Well, I mean, I don't love it. Oh, man. He's so close to finishing the analysis, but it's bedtime. It's sleepy time. Sleepy time. Hey, little guys. Oh. How you doing, Weebu? You hungry? It's almost breakfast time. Let's see, stress? Who's got stress? Monkey's got a little stress. Why are you feeling stressed, Monkey? Oh, probably because you're sopping wet, you're hungry, you got lucky, yucky lungs, and you got low oxygen. That would explain the stress, if you ask me. It's time for some breakfast. Mm, hey, you guys are supposed to wait for Mackenzie. Ah, he doesn't mind. Yeah, you want to talk about the geyser? Yeah, he's like, yeah, I got a geyser to go take care of. But first, I need to go over here and hang out, and then I'm going to go look at that geyser a little bit more. Yeah, up, 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 and away. Here you go, monkey. You're almost done. Look at that. All the ice. All that water. It's frozen. It, it's all frozen now. That's insane. That is no good. Okay, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna cancel this, and then we're gonna grab this guy, and we're gonna build that at a nine there, and then we're gonna do the same there. Okay, now we're gonna take these ladders and build this thing out of granite. We're gonna make it a low, there, low priority, just to get that wood back. I don't know if it really matters that much, but. So I've realized that I've made some miscalculations here, because if we look at it, right, you inhale 130 grams of oxygen per second, when you exhale 2,600 2, milligrams, or is that micrograms? I think it's milligrams, milligrams. So they inhale oxygen and they exhale carbon dioxide at a much lower rate than they inhale. So 2,600 milligrams and this goes through 2,000 milligrams. So one plant isn't even enough for one dupe, it seems. Oh yes, take care of the toilets. I know you hate that job, we do. I know you hate it, everyone hates that job, but somebody has to do it. And we really appreciate you for taking your time to clean that toilet for all of us. Thank you. Thank you very much. All right. What do we have happen in here? Still haven't found the iron volcano, have we? And we could start working on a carbon dioxide system here. Like, maybe? I don't I don't know the best way to approach that. We'll just... Because that's a farmer's nightmare, right? <sighs> like, this is one level, right? Yeah, that's one level. And then... Let's see. Like that. I mean, I guess we can, like, because this is, this is right over the edge here. I don't know. I'm not sure how to address this. I've seen a few people build carbon dioxide reclamation systems with the alveo vera. Because it doesn't get too cold, right? Yeah, no, that, it won't get too cold. What temperature does nectar freeze? Negative 82. Okay, so yeah, we could use nectar to deal with this thing. I think this is our, our next approach. Once we've got this thing finished, these, these pipes done. No power. No power. That's fine. And it's not even pulling anything out of here. There's nothing in this room. This was a bad idea. Let's, um... Oh, we can't even do... Oh, oh, we get a goodie. Oh, give me something good. A snazzy suit. Okay. 
Who gets a snazzy suit? Will it be Mackenzie or Monkey? I think I'm gonna give it to Monkey. Mackenzie will just get it all dirty with all this building. Monkey gets it. We still have food, so that's good. Although, we haven't been cooking. Who cooks? Why are you not cooking? I forget, what is our cook? Who is our cook? Our cook. Oh, it's because he's busy researching. You know what, we're gonna put cooking up first. Because we need that food cooked, because there is not enough. Not enough. Oh, look. We can wrangle you. We can, actually, you know what, let's, um, Let's attack the baby. We will attack the baby. Did you enjoy your meals, folks? What did you eat? Oh, a sherbury. No, they did not enjoy that meal. You gotta get cooking, man. You gotta get cooking. Oh, he got his snazzy suit on. Look at him all snazzy. Look at that. That's a very snazzy suit. It's all sparkly. Oh, I love it. I love it. Okay. So what are we working on here? We've got access to our teleporter. We need to, let, let's work on this guy. Well, we gotta, we gotta finish this. Let's start planning this thing out here. So we're gonna bring it down to this level, I think. And we're gonna take over this entire section just because we can. All right, that makes sense to me. Um, so I don't wanna use snow for, well, actually I guess snow works. I guess that'll work. Oh, we need to dig this stuff out. We'll, 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 we'll let him finish the, the ventilation. He's close to finished. Come on, Mackenzie, you can do it. Yeah, you go get what you need. You got this. You got this, Mackenzie. It ain't gonna help too much, but you got this. Very good. Lots of running. Let's see, do we have skills? Monkey's got a skill. What skill are we giving to him? We're gonna give him... I mean, I guess we should give him something that he wants to do. At least to start. Make him happy. Yes, Mackenzie, yes. I feel almost like, since we're here, we might as well get access to the outside world. I think that might be a good idea. Hmm. Um, I mean space. I want to jettison all my carbon dioxide into space. But for now, I'm just going to let it cycle through here. And we're going to deal with it. All right, uh, we're gonna, so wait, does that mean, that means he finished, oh, he finished building that. Okay, so let's start working on this guy. Um, seven. All right, so let's think about what we want to do here. We need airflow tiles. We need, like, hold on, hold on. First, we need to come down to this level. Let's let's start planning this out with tile, all right? Granite tile is great. And so, actually, no, we want farm tiles. We Uproot, uproot, okay. All right, and these are too tall. That, I think. And then 
we have space for one more. Oh, goody. I don't think that top row is going to get the carbon dioxide that we need, but we'll see. Let's do this. Right? And so we build... that. I almost feel like we need to not do those guys, and instead we build a ladder. Like so. And for now, we're just going to build simple tiles there. We may change it up later. So I did some calculations before. I don't remember the answers, so let's do some more calculations, right? How many licks does it take to get to the center of a Tootsie Roll? I mean, 516 grams per second. And that divided by 2,000 milligrams. Five one six zero 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 divided by two thousand is two hundred and fifty eight plants. That's a lot of plants. Okay. Um, let's see. How do we do this here? I mean, I guess we just go hog wild. We just go crazy. We're gonna start. Um, yeah, let's start by closing this off, right? So we have that there, and then we have this guy here. Right? And then we need to get at it. We're going to get it on this level here. Is that right? Hold on, something ain't right. Maybe we, do we go on a low level, and then we go up? Maybe that's what we do. Yeah, that's what we're going to do. We're going to start here. And then we're going to take this guy, and we're going to go all the way across there to start. And then we go, I don't want to deal with this stuff over here for now, so we're not going to. All right, so if we look at this and we go like that, that is 32 tiles. So what is what was my math again here? 258 divided by 32. Eight, that's only eight of these? Yeah, this, this may actually work out okay. This may be just about the right amount of space for what I'm trying to build here. And this guy needs to go all the way up there like that. This is going to be just one massive chamber here, I tell you what. that for now we can keep this side closed in while we work on the rest of it because i don't want to release a ton of carbon dioxide oh wait i don't want to do this after all no that's what i want i want to be as high as we can when we go in because of the fact that we don't want to leak out too much carbon dioxide you know I feel like since this is going to be pumping out liquid carbon dioxide, we're going to have to let it warm up a bit and deliquify. And maybe this is not the place for this. Maybe, maybe this whole thing needs to be. Maybe. We'll see how that goes. The bottom doesn't necessarily need to be, but the top. Like, the, the other question is, like, will it overpressurize? 
because I don't want too much carbon dioxide if it can't suck it up because it's just going to pour out. Okay, let's do this. We need to put one of these guys here. No, not there. That, yeah, that'll be fine. For now. Speaking of fine for now, do we have any oxygen up here? Oh, we are suffering. We are suffering. It's fine though, okay. So we need this done and this done, and then we need to dig through here. Maybe, I don't know what to do here exactly, like, cause we need to be able to get in here. Maybe just temporarily get in here, I don't know. This guy's gonna have, oh, that guy can move. We can deconstruct that guy, yeah. We can deconstruct this guy, too. That's perfect, yeah, they don't need to be here. Now that we have this one here, polluted water, yep, and we got that guy there. Okay, we got, we got a place for those things, so that's good. I mean, it's far away from where we, from where we are, but that's okay. We can get there, everything's good up there for now, that's fine. So we're going to have, we're not going to be, actually, we're not going to be sucking oxygen out of this thing at all, right? It's just going to be carbon dioxide filling this entire thing. Cold, cold carbon dioxide. Oh no, you're not going to get stuck, are you? You're going to get stuck. Mackenzie, this was a bad idea. Oh boy, what are you going to do? What are you going to do now, huh? I'm going to have to let you out, aren't I? Yep, Mackenzie's screwed. Not too worried about down here yet. Okay. Yeah, you're, you're in so much trouble, Mackenzie. Once this place is sealed off, which is pretty close to being, like, oh, Mackenzie, oh, how, how bad of you, you should not have done that. Oh, boy. What are you doing over here, Weebu? No, 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 no. Why are you mining some... P1 stuff instead of other things. Oh, Mackenzie. You know what? I think we're going to have to let Mackenzie out. I didn't want to be doing this, but I think we have to let Mackenzie out. There. Okay. We'll fix that later. Oh, boy. So we're looking at, how many of these we got? 32 of those, okay. Oh, not enough oxygen anywhere at all. We're very close, let's see. What are you doing over here, Weeboo? What are you doing? You're like, I'm helping. Thought, wait, hold on. Weeboo's priorities are farming and ranching. Is there no farming and ranching work to be done? Oh, look, we have another animal to kill. Nice. Oh, y'all are cramped, which means... Wait, we have an egg to move. Why haven't anybody moved this egg? Move the egg, gosh darn it. They're too busy doing everything else. Finally. That's more like it. Okay. Now, 
don't somebody think of the plants? Come on, guys. We have oxygen just waiting. What are you doing? Idle? Why? Who? Why are you idle? There's so much you could be doing right now. Oh, here we go. What are we going to get? What are we going to get? Oh, just what we need. Water. That's going to turn to a block of ice and freeze our frosty printing pod in no time. Bedtime. Sleepy, sleepy time. Where's Weeboo? What? Oh. Oh, I see what happened now. No wonder Weeboo's being strange. He got stuck over here. My bad. Yeah, see, I need to put fire poles in, and I haven't even unlocked fire poles yet. So he's... Yeah. Oh, man. No, no oxygen. Oh, man. Oh, man. We need to... You know what I'm going to do? I am going to set everyone... Set everyone to build, but maybe not so much. Maybe we don't. Well, we. We. I don't. I don't know what to think. I don't know what to do. I'll just leave it be. Leave them. Leave them do what they do. If somebody dies, then so be it. Like this was not a solution. This is not working the way I wanted it to. Like it's not emitting polluted oxygen like I expected it to. So. Our next solution here is this guy. So that's what we're gonna do. We're gonna copy that. There we go. Let's see. We need to go this way, and then we need to go that way. I'm sure that there are gonna be other things I'm gonna have to do here too, but. Let him do as much of that as he can down there. I just hope that the negative 55 temperature from the carbon dioxide isn't too low and gives us frostbite. Like I was saying, I, I, there, there was a planet here, um, one of the actual other planetoids. Uh, I sent a couple dupes to via rocket and it was the icy one. And like they immediately, like they were they were frost proof too. I, I gave them the frost proof, right? Where is it here? Where, where is it? Frost proof. Immune to chilly surroundings. Well, you know what? Frost proof. It uh, it's not the same as being frost bite proof. So yeah. Oh, that's right. There's more to do. Once I yeah, this is gonna have to be redone completely. But for now, this will do. Because, like, I want to set it up so it's all automated so I don't have to have a dupe spend all their time in here doing stuff. But we'll, we'll see how it goes. We're going to slowly work on this thing. We just got to get this first section going, get it opened up to let the carbon dioxide flow. Let the carbon dioxide flow. You know, like, let the hate flow. Yes, let the hate flow. Or something. What are these made out of? Made out of dirt. Why am I making them out of dirt instead of clay? Oh, I don't... Oh, wow, I have a lot of dirt, but very little clay. Never mind, that's right. These guys make dirt. Oh, we're cramped again. Means we got another Bamini egg. That would be Frost Fawn. Fawn, 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 Flocks. Fawn. Oh yeah, give him a little brush. Give oh you look at his little tongue sticking out. He's so happy. Oh, you're so happy. So happy. Together. You know what? Cancel. Let's cancel all this. Because I don't need them working on this right now until 
it's ready because we'll just be wasting materials for a while. I just want it built, done. Um, I need this one built too. So let's set these actually at an eight. There, okay, let's set that as an eight. So Mackenzie will build this guy, right? Maybe, oh, maybe in the morning. No? Where's Mackenzie? Oh, Mackenzie is doing it. Yep, 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 make it so. I just need to close off that gap real quick so that I can open up the carbon dioxide and let's see what it does. See how much of a mistake this is going to be. Oh boy. Okay, it's fine. Oh, it's bedtime. Oh, poor Mackenzie's going to bed late. We got an ox light there, though, so that's good. Oh, slowly but surely. Oh, we got rid of our stress. That's, that's good. No stress, Mackenzie. Oh, boy. So this guy. Let's turn this guy down to a 7 for now, because we're not even getting anything in here worth moving. So this is probably going to be a redo eventually. Maybe not. We'll see. We need this to get finished here. Oh, breakfast time. I can't believe I almost... Oh, look at you. Monkey's got some barbecue. Ooh, everybody got some barbecue this morning. That's a good breakfast right there. Locks fawn barbecue, baby. Ain't nothing sweeter. Right? Okay, now Mackenzie, can you can you get to work on this guy, right? Yeah, good, good, okay. Got a little breathing down here. Yep, up, yep, up. There you go. And there's some more dirt there if you need it. Nope, nope, where are you going? Nope, hold on. Uh, uh, no, Mackenzie, no. There, that's better. Now... Finish this area here. I guess I could have let you build that one, but that one's not super important yet. It's up here that matters, and then here. Coming along, it's coming along. You know what? I need a fresh cup of coffee. So we will we will watch Mackenzie run around and build this, and I will be right back.
back just in time to watch Mackenzie use the toilet. How about that? How are we doing? How far do we get? Oh, we're not, we're not doing too bad. Maybe, no, not this cycle. Maybe next cycle he can have this thing finished. I'm hopeful. Okay, let's look at our priorities again. Farming comes first. Because we need to farm. Oh, out of order already. Didn't so, didn't Mackenzie just do that? <sighs> Who has what is that? That's tidying. Tidying. We need to give somebody a tidying, like above all. Not our builder, not our cook. Not our farmer. You know what? Let's make our farmer. That's weird. Oh, oh, everybody's got like, okay, so that's their primary job if their primary job is busy, you know, cook research, tidy, build, dig, tidy, farm, ranch, tidy. No, we're going to, we're going to make that one double digits. Oh, it's breakfast time. It's breakfast time. Oh, you got yourself some barbecue. Mackenzie got barbecue. Everybody's got barbecue again. Oh, yum, 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 yum. How much bar? Oh, wow. We got so much meat too. Oh, that's great. They're gonna be eating like kings. They got bar. Oh man, they have so much meat and barbecue. Wow. Okay. Somebody. Oh yeah. Good. Empty that. Empty that, Weeboo. Yeah. Yeah. I think that's better. Our farm and our rancher, the guy who's working in the dirt and cleaning the animals all the time, he's the one that's gonna keep the toilets clean for now. For now. Um. You know, I think. I think it's time to copy those there since yeah that's fine that'll be fine I just hope this doesn't turn out horribly horribly bad we'll get there so in case I haven't mentioned it today is Saturday the 10th of August um what is new? What is new? There's, a, there's not a whole lot new right now, I don't think. But that, I know. Uh, things happening in the world. Um, financial crisis. Yeah, big time. Really? I don't know. Anyway. Yeah, sherberries here. Man, I want to eat a sherbury, right? Like, look at that. Doesn't that look delicious? A cold, seedless fruit that triggers mild brain freeze. Okay, maybe, maybe it's not so great. And done. There we go. Okay. So next, we've got to go. All this. This is good. Beautiful. Let's start with. There we go, okay. Hey, why didn't that one get done? That's weird. He's planting, though. He's planting. Oh, you're having a hard time breathing over here, huh? I wonder why. Oh, that's why. Do we release the carbon dioxide now? I think we should. I think we should. Since we have some plants in here. Uh, no, you know what, let's set those at a seven. You get going. Yeah, you get it. Actually, you know what? This side doesn't matter so much. Let's go five there. Actually, let's set these to four. This one, these two to six there. Okay, that's fine. 
Okay. I did not mean to make those nine, but that's fine. I just need to get... I need to get this stuff dug up. Oh, just so that we can get the carbon dioxide flowing. And then worry about the rest of it later. Because just what? Oh, it's overpressure. That's, that's a good sign, actually. Uh-oh. Breathing trouble. Uh-oh. Weeboo's got some breathing trouble. Let's see. Where is there... You know what? Let's tell him to move here. Hopefully he can get there before he runs out of breath and dies. Ooh, new printable! What are we getting? A Sweetle? Okay. We'll take a Sweetle. And we will move the Sweetle over here. No, move it over here. Okay, what do we have priority-wise? Okay. Just a couple for now. We'll, we'll, we'll be fine. Figure this all out. But yeah, the Sweetle, that is unusual. Ah, oh, I hate you. I hate you, chat person, who isn't really a chat person, but we're going to hit your button, and we're going to report you, and you're going to get banned immediately. Spam scams your bots. Spam. There's your message. Report again. Report again. Spam, scam, or bots. Obviously, it's a scam. Report again. Spam, scam, or bot. Obviously, it's a bot and not a real person doing this. Thank you, thank you. And then you're going to get a ban. Okay. I hate the. I hate it. I just have, oh, none of our plants are growing right now. All right, here's hoping that this actually works out and doesn't cause huge issues because this stuff comes out super cold. Like, super cold. <sighs> to the point where it has to warm up. Is there, okay, let's see. Carbon, liquid carbon dioxide. It has to get, it only has to get like seven degrees warmer, so that shouldn't be too bad considering how warm everything around it is. But I might end up having to put a liquid, liquid tepidizer down there. Which I don't have access to right now. Oh no! It just went dormant! Are you kidding me? Wow. Hold on, I gotta take a look at the default on the carbon dioxide geyser. Wow. This thing's going to be dormant for like many, many, many days. That's crazy. Oh, what luck. There goes all of our... Okay, now we just have to find... We're going to have to make our way in here to a bunch of oxalite then, I think. Like, that's really our only option. That'll get us some oxygen, slowly, but some. And like, we got oxygen trapped up in here. All right, so here's what we're gonna do. We are going to cancel these four. And then we are going to dig these guys up. Yeah. Because we don't need these here using up all of our um, ice. We're gonna get half of this thing started and going here. We're just gonna... That. That. Dig all of this out, mostly. 
set our priorities straight here. Yeah, that's fine. That's fine. That's perfect priority-wise. Yeah, that's good. That's good. Okay, because you got all this stuff down here. Okay. So far, so good. So far, so good. <laughs> you know what? Let's dig up these guys, too. Um, oh, look at that. We have a nine over here. Okay, so you'll get there. Why are you doing this instead of doing digging up there? Okay, that's fine. We need that. Cannot believe this stupid thing just went dormant. So it has a 55 dormancy period, maybe? Or a 55 active period? Maybe. Maybe. We'll see. All right, so again, we're looking 32, 64, 128, and we needed 200 something. So yeah, we have to like double the size of this thing. And then we have to account for spacing changes when we're ready to um, barbecue time, huh? What do we got? We got lots of barbecue again. Everybody's getting some barbecue. Barbecue, yeah. You got some barbecue. Yeah, everybody's got the barbecue today. Yum, yum, yum. What are we moving here? Oh, that's right. Nothing important. Although, do we have the ability? No, we do not. Okay, that's fine. You know what, actually, I want to... I didn't realize that I had these blueprints for other things. Like... Is it this one? No, I, I have some other blueprints here. I was just looking at them. Like, I have... Oh, yeah, the grooming station. What about this guy? Nope. I just don't, I don't have a lot of blueprints unlocked, unfortunately. Um, let's look. What other what other blueprints do we have here for furnished buildings? We have oh yeah, we have planter boxes. We have the purple water cooler, flower pot, two beds, lamp. Okay. Hmm. No different blueprint for the mass table? No, 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 no. Okay, that's fine. <clears throat> okay, guys. If you need oxygen, you move out here. There. That was not good enough, because there's not enough oxygen there for them to breathe. <clears throat> Sweetle tending? I mean, the plants aren't going to do anything, so... <clears throat> okay, what can we do here? You... Are you producing... I mean, there's a little bit of oxygen here. Now, maybe... What do I do here? I don't know. This is fairly centered in the world. I mean, not quite dead center. Like, if we zoom out and we put it here, dead center is closer to, like, here, where the printing pot itself is. I think that line is not too bad. I think. I think. I think. Mackenzie, is that what you're supposed to be working on? I guess so. I guess, because there's nothing more to do over here. See, it constantly says producing zero. I mean, obviously this spot that we're looking at here is not bubbling. Hopefully it will start bubbling, show us. See, now it's bubbling, but it's still not producing. Okay, so it is producing a little bit. It just needs to spread out. It's just so cold that it freezes instead of spreading. 
Was this buried before? I don't think this was buried before. I think Mercury melted and then refroze. Oh, I was like wondering why that wasn't happening because I forgot to set that. That's okay. Hey, Mackenzie's got some oxalite. That's just what we need. And he's taking it to the toilet with him? Wasn't he supposed to put it here? Maybe, oh, it probably disappeared before he, uh, before he made it to his destination with it. Or maybe he dropped it. No, he didn't drop it. He's picking up oxalite. And if we look what he's got in his hands here, he's carrying, maybe, where is it? Hey, oxalite. 27.2? No, okay. Alright. I don't know what happened to that last piece. Maybe he didn't pick it up in time? <clears throat> Who knows? But we still got a little bit of oxygen. And we're gonna get a little bit more from this. Well, tomorrow. Maybe. Maybe. Sleepy time. Sleepy, sleepy, sleepy time. Oh, Weebu needs oxygen. He's holding his breath in his sleep while going <laughs> because there's so. Oh my goodness, that's a lot of carbon dioxide right there. A lot of carbon dioxide. Why are these guys? Why are they not getting the carbon dioxide? Yeah, these guys are. What's wrong with your atmosphere? Like it. Really? Whatever. Oh, breakfast time. Oh man, Weebu is super happy right now. Where do I see their super happiness? Yeah, yeah. Hi, morale. Balloon artist planning to hand out balloons in their downtime. Nice. But they got no downtime, so. Sorry about that. Yes, release the oxygen, Mackenzie. It's gonna be a lot of a digging, but it'll be worth it. I promise, I hope. I really hope so. Oh, he's running out of oxygen, trying to get more. Oh, we have skills. Skills to pay the bills. Weebu, I'm gonna give you critter ranching too. Give you improved construction. Perfect, that was easy. That was an easy choice. Oh, look at you, you are so happy. Look at you. Oh, and you're now the center of attention and everything. To your stress, high morale. Low oxygen is a problem. The morale is real high. Is that what this is? He's like, or I don't know. He's just, he's super happy. That's all I know. So super happy. Are we on animals and eggs? Another move to do. We're going to set that one to super high priorities since they just won't do anything. Look at the Sweetle. Very unhappy Sweetle because he's a little cold. He's not too cold, but he's a little cold. He's a tiny baby, though. Tiny babies don't, don't tend to plants, I guess. Monkey's going to town over here on this geyser. Gonna tell us how long we have to wait until we get more oxygen again. Oh, here's oxygen. Speaking of which, yeah, look at all that. Oh, that's what we desperately needed. And this is still considered a... Ooh, it is not. Because it is too big because we need to build this. That's why. That should fix it. 
Luckily, we have so much food right now, it doesn't matter that our plants aren't even growing. Oh my goodness, you are way too happy here, Weeboo. You look kind of scary looking like that. So happy. We're gonna go until we hit cycle 60. And then I gotta get my day going. Hopefully before cycle 60, Monkey will be done with this so we will know how many cycles we have to wait before we are allowed to breathe well, maybe, hopefully. Hopefully. He's having trouble making it happen because he can't breathe, right? What do we have in here in the way of gas? Like, it's a little... It's not... It's, like, very, very little of anything. Like, yikes. Just a few grams of atmosphere is kind of crazy. We could do with two more floxes. That'll do. Okay. Oh, we have a new printable. Brine, or we'll take the spores because we don't need liquids. Right now, liquids are bad news bears. Sleepy guys. Hopefully now they'll be able to breathe a bit better, maybe, because we got all this oxygen coming on up here. Speaking of which, did the room become a room again? It did. Good. Very good. Uh-oh, we boo's holding breath again. Deliver to move here. Oh, breakfast time. Got more barbecue? Yep, we got more barbecue. Everybody got their barbecue. Yum, 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 barbecue. Everybody got. Oh, they love oxalite. Oxalite's the best. Without all that oxalite, we wouldn't be able to breathe because, you know, oxygen is not included. Oh, there's your downtime. Oh yeah, fill that with water. Good job. What you doing, monkey? You gonna go study the geyser some more and hopefully finish it today? I don't see that happening because he needs to breathe and there's nothing to breathe here. He's just slowly rubbing the geyser like, Tell me your secrets. Oh, I can't breathe. I must go get some oxygen. Tell me, carbon dioxide geyser SK39-1, what are your secrets? When do you explode? When do you stop exploding? Anyway. We'll get there. How are we? Got that? Oh, we got that going okay. Yep, yep, yep. So far, so good. Where is everyone working now? Are we on move? Well, we're up to 300 grams. We're going to let this guy just kind of sit and do for now. Like, this is low priority, so he's just coming up here to get stuff. So if we look at the overlay, 300, 400, 400, 900. That's actually some good oxygen up there. Oh, it's because of this guy. Yeah, okay, that's fine. No worries, because oxygen will hopefully kind of spread out and down a little bit here. Just like, I'm hoping for this stuff to spread into the rest of the base. Oh, monkey, can you get it done in just two days? I think you can. I think he might do it. I think he might do it. Where is everyone else? Where is everybody else? Okay, here's Weeboo. What are you doing, Weeboo? You going to get some phosphorite? Oh, you're going to go store some ice. Okay. 
Oh, and Mackenzie's up here working on this one. Um, you know what? We'll let this thing keep doing. We'll let him build this for now. All right. Actually, we should probably work down here more just to prepare. So this is at five. Let's set this one at seven. Like that, right? Uh-oh. Okay, it's like, the monkey's having breathing trouble. And we'll be more than happy to let um, Mackenzie finish this little bit here. Oh, look at that. We can get to this thing now. Almost. We already inspected that. Good, good. Oh, you gotta use the toilet, Mackenzie. Oh, it's toilet time. Wash those hands, so... Five kilograms of water per use. So if it's five kilo, why is it at... Oh, okay. A odd number. I guess, I mean, you... you uh, five... It's... I guess. It's weird, I don't know why. Uh-oh, it's bedtime. Only two more cycles to go. Will Monkey get it done? I think he might. I think he just might. Oh, and my coffee's all gone. Had my second cup, so it's almost end of the time. Yes. What's new here? Oh, yeah. Wattage sensor. I don't need a wattage. Wattage sensor. I've got a wattage sensor. Something in here is heavy. I swear I saw a gas. There it is. 400 or 4,000. That's, that's, that's heavy, heavy, heavy polluted oxygen right there. at that. Wow. Oh, breakfast time. Barbecue for me and you. It's so delicious and we have so much more meat to cook. Nice. Nice. Alright, guys. Let's get our job done down here. Stretch. Oh, monkey, you can do it. Gotta stop for those oxygen breaks, though. Uh oh, Mackenzie. There you go. There you go. So close. If only it would be breathable in here. Come on, monkey. Monkey, monkey, monkey man. These guys don't actually give off any heat, right? No, okay, yeah. I, I feel like a liquid tepidizer might be necessary down here. Just just a little bit. But we'll we'll see what happens. We'll we'll worry about that when the time comes. Cause like the tepidizer is expensive. Like, 960 watts of power that's a lot of power but again we only need to run it for like a second just enough to warm up this thing by a few degrees like seven or ten degrees or something i'm just hopeful that there's enough heat in this area anyway that to make that just but for the most part oh mackenzie How did you manage that? Come on. 
quickly before it's too late. Mackenzie, go here. Uh-oh, he's gonna die. He's gonna die. Don't die. Oh, that was a close call. Stupid guy putting things in the wrong place. Uh, anyway, that's that's dupes for you. Oh, 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 so close. Come on. Last little bit here. Before the day is out. Pretty please with sugar on top. Come on, monkey. You're so close. Just a little bit. Oh. No, Mackenzie, don't do it. He cannot figure out where to go. Maybe that'll help. Does that help? Where are you going, you dummy? No, there's no oxygen there. Move there. You know what? Let's open this door, too. Let's set that door to open. Did he, he did it. He did it. Okay, we have 45 more cycles to go until this geyser is active. So... There really is no need to work on any of this for now. Okay. That's fine, I guess. Like, well, we'll let it be. So we have to think of other ways to get oxygen for the next 45 cycles. I mean, I guess I can just look for oxalite everywhere, right? That, that's like, that's a long time. How do I get oxygen? You know, if you have any thoughts or suggestions on how I can get oxygen, I am open to your ideas because so far what I've got going here is not going to work. Neither of my solutions for oxygen are going to work. Huh, okay. Ah, that's what I need to do. Okay, that's my next step here. What are we researching now? We're working on this thing. I feel like what we should be working on is this guy right here instead. Let's go switch it up. We'll get that petroleum generator. And what we'll do is we will build a petroleum generator to make warm. Oh, wait, hold on a second. Yes. Ooh, okay. So what do we do? We build it down here maybe? Yeah, yeah, here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna build that and then we're gonna build that and then we'll build a generator room down here. Okay, so let's let's start working on this here, shall we? Okay, so here. Okay. And one, 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 two. Okay, so this just a group that for now right so we need to dig this out like so and what we do here is we build a subfloor of mesh right we could you know what let's put a plumbing Liquid pump there. That for now. Build another one like that because we want to put a liquid sensor in there, maybe. And then we're going to have to start sucking up all this ethanol and use it for power, I think. And that will save us a lot of effort and time because there is so much ethanol around, and that will give us warm polluted water and then that carbon dioxide from this thing will warm this up is that is that enough space 
I hope that's enough space for a generator. Anyway. So let's set Monkey down cooking secondary now because we have tons of food. Okay, 22 and 14, and we can set him back up to cook again later here once he's uh, through the research well enough. So good. Oh, look at all that. It's, 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 it's no good. It's no good, I tell you. It's no good. Okay. This is our next step here. We need to... that and this carbon dioxide will also allow us to um it'll warm it but we'll also be keeping the generator cool you see i think that'll work out pretty well although again i may have to worry about pressure but if that time comes, I can put a pump in here to suck stuff out that way, I think. I really wish there were like a, a post-it note. Oh wait, we're cycle 60. We gotta stop now. Oh no. Oh no. There. So that, we'll set that at nine for next time. Yes, perfect, okay. Well, I think this is it. Once this day closes, we're going to end the stream. And we're going to keep our fingers crossed that we're going to finally get some oxygen in this place. I mean, it's not so bad right now, but it's not great. That's for sure. Like, we still have this stuff to work on. We've got all this ethanol to collect here and up here and up here and up here. And then we've got all these little guys that we can collect their ethanol in time. So yeah, we 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 okay. <laughs> oh boy, I still don't know where that iron volcano is yet, do I? Let's see. Anything new? We have this guy. We have this guy. You do not appear to have uncovered anything new. That's okay. Oh, Mackenzie's getting to work. Doing the work. Do, 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 doing the work. But yeah, so if we take the polluted water from here and then we pump it up into here, it'll melt this ice and it'll give stuff off. Oh, here's a printable. What do we get? What do we get? Oh, obsidian. Yeah, we're going to take the obsidian. No real use for it, but it's better than seeds that don't do me any good and we will watch them sleep oh aren't they the cutest thank you so much for joining me i hope you enjoy this series i hope they my three little dupes survive but stay tuned for next time oh look we have two snazzy suits i just realized we need to get a snazzy suit for for mackenzie next but that's it it's the end of our day breakfast time will come again later. Bye-bye.